Okay, uh, before we get to the 240Z, check out this amazing Bentley. I got this from Rick at Whole Lot of Zip. He's a, a really cool guy. Um, loves his 70s rock, uh, and I can get with that all day long. Rick, thank you so much for this car, friend. Um, this is awesome. I've got a couple of these already by Mini GT. I've got, I, I guess, the lava orange is what they called it, and then this blue color. And uh, I love the casting. I love how Mini GT did this one. And I have actually been looking at this one, and Rick has just gone and surprised me with it. So let's take a look at it. Um, let's keep these other ones over here just for comparison's sake. I like how this green one, it's, uh, it's a racing edition, obviously but I like how it's got the blacked out wheels. Let's get it out and take a look at it. Didn't uh, didn't trade anything for Rick or anything like that. He's just been a really awesome friend of my channel. He's got a new one. I'm gonna link it uh, at the end of this video and also in the description. I hope you'll you know give him a shot and go check it out. Uh, you guys all know Mini GT already. I don't have to explain that you get a really cool, nice storage box with each one. Uh, they are absolutely officially licensed. In fact, um, one time I got I got this one actually from Bentley on their website. I went to look and uh, see if they had 164 diecast, and that is the one that they had on there. So I had them send that to me. I've got a cool box like this, but it's got Bentley on it. So it's pretty neat. Uh, kind of a dealer exclusive uh, box anyway. So let's look at this one. Uh, let's start right off with some of the differences. Um, we've got the 100 on the grill and I cannot remember what that was for. It may be a hundred years of Bentley. I probably should have looked that up before. Uh, I got started, but I didn't, so here we are. Um, it's really cool, the uh, lens headlamps on it, nice painted front bumper, the grill is all over the place, lens headlamps, even the little ones are lens. You got a really nice Bentley badge on it. You got the black glass roof. This is a fantastic version of this car. Look how on the glass you've even got the the mirror um, part in there. I don't know what you call that. What, what is the purpose of that? You know, it's almost like a weather stripping around the window dips down for the mirror. I don't know, maybe that, maybe that doesn't uh, let the gum and the mirror heat up. Who knows, I'm just making up stuff. All right, so we got weather uh, stripping around the window, black trim there, we got a really nice, um, Bentley logo on the fender. Let's see if any of this other stuff is going to come off. Just nice paintwork on the rocker. I love these wheels. Check out the end caps. Is that a Bentley logo on the wheel caps? So on these mini GTs, you're going to get a metal base screwed in. There's all the information you get on those couple of side view mirrors with no reflective inside it. Look on the rear here, you've got a nice, looks like a longer yellow UK registration plate. You've got a Bentley logo on the rear body. You've got lens tail lamps. That's pretty good. Let's see, is that on the same? See, I think on this one, yeah, those are lensed. Okay. Um, Finished looking at this one. Just a beauty of a car, Rick. I love, love UK stuff. I love uh, European stuff, but I really love my uh, British stuff. This is uh, this is an outstanding one. I've got a shelf that's got you know my Bentleys with my other ballers vehicles, um, and I'll. Uh, I'll gladly put this one in there. But now it's time for the another new RLC. My buddy got his 240Z. I'll be right back and we'll take a look at the newest RLC from Hot Wheels. Okay, uh, you guys know the deal. We will do a 
live unboxing here. Um, well, I say that. I, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I have already taken this out and showed it to him so that he knows what his registration number was and to make sure there were no defects so we didn't have to send it back. But here is the box for the custom 72 Datsun 240Z. They've been all in on these pretty generic white and black outer boxes. Uh, the Mangusta was in one. You guys recall seeing that not too long ago. Here is your cardboard, it's almost like a slip cover for the acrylic case that is beneath it. Here is his registration number. Got a pretty good low number on this one. Here it is, guys. Look at that thing shine. Um, how can I show this off best? So we'll, we'll do that for now. And get this. I'm not going to take it off the base. I will give us some close-up glamour shots of it going around the turntable. We'll take a look at it real quick right there. And then we're going to put this off to the side and we'll get some up close and personal. So we've got like a matte black mixed in with the gold. We've got where to start. Okay, so we got really cool wheels. We got uh, 10 spokes on there. We've got silver on the outer rim of the wheel. This is a wide body, a custom 240Z. You know, it's the casting. We've seen it several times from Hot Wheels. Uh, got your sponsorship tag on the rear, paint for your lamps, and you've got two different color reds on there. You've got orange on top, red on the bottom. Tail pipe is done. It's painted with a drop of black to simulate a little bit of depth. I don't think it goes too deep in there. The spoiler is in matte black, as is the stripe down the entire body. You get 240 on the hatch back here. You got trim around the windows. You've got a roll cage in there. Looks like you've got multiple colors on the interior. And I'm saving the best for last. Don't worry, we'll we'll look under the hood. The hood is really well done. That line splits. That line splits the hood in half and you've got uh, you got the mirrors on the fenders okay so here is the best part of this vehicle under the hood detail all your cylinders your cover and yeah they just went all out on that engine well done um, look in the back here. I don't know what's going on back here. It's like a compartment for a wheel, but there is no spare tire back there. Um, yeah, it's a cool one. 240 Custom Z. Let's get it on the turntable. We'll let it go around and catch some of the light here. And um, that'll be all I got for you today. Hope you enjoy it. Take a look at this. I'll get you get this camera set up. I'm just gonna do it live today. What do y'all think of the wheels? I'm I'm kind of digging the wheels. They're pretty good on this car. I think this was I mean, I know we've, we've seen this casting a lot, but I remember it from, it was a premium in one of the Fast and Furious sets. All right, well, I hope you like it. I'll be sending this one on down the road across the Atlantic. My buddy Christian has all of these awesome RLCs. 
Hope you enjoyed taking a look at it today with me. Uh, hang around the channel if you're new. I'm going to a couple diecast shows uh, this weekend and next, and hopefully we'll have some good footage of what is available in Alabama and Tennessee at a diecast show. Talk to you guys later. Have a great evening. I'll see you on the next one. This is David at Twice Diecast.